face it, I'm weak. I'm a weak individual. I'm weak in thinking that we can all get along and we can all see things from other people's perspective. I'm weak in thinking that people can respect other people. I leave and run as far away as possible. Put my head down and I think about the things I've said and when all is lost and everyone that knows me tells me what they think and their opinions on what I am and what I've done so far in this YouTube and I say I'm done it's over with I owe myself four more videos Leave it at 150. 365 would have been a year. Leave it at 150. Call it a day. And I comment on some shit that is completely outrageous and compromise could have been. So in looking at it from the other person's perspective and speaking on it from the other person's perspective, everybody from the other side hated on me. Disrespect from children. Being called foul things. Things have been said about you that you don't want to be sad about you. People that don't know you see your face and assume the things that are said about you are true. And for that, I was scared. How can you scare the real AIX? You don't scare him. You scare the child that was abused that was inside of him. You scare the person that was disrespected and abused that's inside of him. You scare the person that makes up the core of his being. Everyone, every single individual has two sides. The person that everyone sees and the person is that at home that's at home and the person that's at home is the one that the people at home see and those are the people truly those are the only ones that really matter your opinion is singular one Let me put my finger in the right spot your opinion is one. One opinion. One perspective. And someone once told me, if you think a certain way, there's at least 20,000 people that think the same way you do. Another 450,000 people willing to think the same way those 20,000 do. And another four million people willing to think the way the 400,000 do. Did I say that right? If I didn't, then I am now saying it right. For every thought that you have, there is at least a thousand people that think like you do. There's another 50 or 20,000 people willing to conform to the thoughts that these people think. If one person has one bad thought about you, then that may be 140,000 people that think opposite that you do. One 
One opinion sways these people. One opinion can sway everyone's opinion for or against you. How can we survive in a world where the cards are stacked against you? When you can say one thing that everybody agrees upon and then one thing everyone disagrees upon, which ideology will be placed upon you? The one that everybody agreed with or the one that everybody disagreed with? It's the negativity that wins. You cannot be right if the other person is right and you're always wrong. It's the negativity that wins. Negative is popular. This is the very last time I will speak on this situation. In order to say something positive, I did not say anything negative. Even though the situation called for a negative comment, I truly believe I took the steps in which to say something negative in a positive manner in which to enlighten people. If it's fine in here, in here, in here, and in there, and when it's done right here, no one thinks it's fine. But in every other situation, what was done is fine and it's all good. But in this one situation, everything was wrong. Is it right to call a child a whore? A crackhead? A stripper? A prostitute? If you saw the person doing those things, fine. I always say perception is our judge and that we must be judged by only one and that is God but if perception is our judge and we all are born in God's image then is perception godly when everybody perceives a situation one way I feed off the timer, I feed off music, I feed off the things around me. Am I wrong? To make a statement in a positive manner to show somebody that they're wrong, cover yourself up. That made me a pervert. But we can grab a magazine and look at Molly Cyrus just like you'll see me right now. And this is okay for a young lady to be like this. This is okay for any woman to be like this. How many times have young fashion models have had to make that same pose and they weren't called whore slut crack fiend fifty dollar hooker how many times have we looked at these magazines and said oh that dress looks good and did not know how old the model was but you can pass judgment on somebody. Call them out their name. But understand this. 